our own uh, insights. Uganda Management Institute and Karibu East Africa have organized a public lecture on Uganda's contribution to the social and economic development of the East African community since 1993. The public lecture at Uganda Management Institute attracted brains in political and economic spheres. State Minister for Foreign Affairs in charge of regional cooperation, John Mulimba, represented the Minister for East African Community Affairs, Rebecca Gadaga. Top on agenda was the need for the East African community to stand firm in promoting integration. Without affording economic integration to provide market for our producing families and companies to be assured of the market, on principles of competitiveness. The integrated Africa will not only stimulate production in Africa, it will also enable us to negotiate credibly with other big markets such as USA, China, India, Russia, Europe, European Union, ETC. The former speaker of the East African Legislative Assembly, Margaret Nantongo Zwa, commended Uganda's contribution to the ESC. And what allow me to also mention that Uganda has made commendable contribution in the education of East Africans. Since the privatization of the education sector in Uganda in 1997 and the introduction of the universal private education and universal secondary education in the fulfillment of the Millennium, millennium Development Goals, opportunities opened to many East African children to enjoy free and affordable education at all levels. At primary levels, many people of primary going age have been able to enjoy free education across borders. At DRC Bombay, children are seen crossing to Uganda. Ugandan businessman Mike Mukula and a former member of the East African Legislative Assembly, Mukasambide, agree that ESC and Africa need to work together for transformation. The African continent must survive. If we don't survive by coming together, we are already a nation among nations or a continent still at risk. In my opinion, I think we need to concretize, first of all, the trade between Uganda and the Congo DRC alone can supplant all the trade we expect between Uganda and Europe combined. So why don't we look at this as a material discussion and a decision to be made for Uganda? Uganda Management Institute also launched the executive training course in regional integration for the East African community. Adiana Kuti, UBC. And the first woman for that 